hi guys welcome to my channel how are you doing today today i want to teach you how to make a boss pleated skirt in like five minutes or six minutes you see easiest method to make a boss pleated skirt but before we go into that i want to say a big thank you to all my subscribers those who have been subscribing to my channel I really, really want to say thank you guys. Thank you for your support. Thank you for your appreciation. Your subscribing to my channel has really given me, you know, the courage to, to do something, to post more content, to share more, more ideas on my, on my Facebook channel. So I'm really, really very grateful. Thank you to those who have subscribed my channel. Thank you. And if you have not subscribed, please, please subscribe. Your subscribing will encourage me to do more. Thank you so much. So today I'll be teaching you how to make a boss pleated skirt. I wanted to make this skirt, so I, I was like, okay, let me let me share it so somebody might benefit from doing it. So let's get into it. So I'm going to teach you the DIY method. I'm not going to go into the 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 complicated method of like uh, a professional way of making it. It's DIY. This is DIY. What you can quickly make in case you have a party to attend a ball day and you were like, okay, what can I quickly make to wear? This is the method. I'm, this is the method I'm going to share today. Okay. So what you are going to do is you are going to mark one inch. You mark one inch from the edge of your fabric. You mark one inch. Then you mark three, three inches, three, three inches or four inches. You continue marking. I don't know if you can see what I'm doing. You continue marking three, three inches, like three, six, nine, 12, 15, 18. So you mark that on your fabric, 21, until you get your desired waist, okay? Until you get your desired waist. So I continue marking. This is a three yard fabric depending on your waist if you are on the plus size range you know you might need up to three yards if you are not that if you are a petite you might need like two and a half you know two two and a half to make your style so you continue marking three three inches on your fabric uh, i should have put in my pins here so after that, after you have marked three, three inches, then you start pleating. You see, I've marked three, three inches on my fabric. Then you start pleating like this. Okay. You start pleating each fabric. And the next one, you are going to pleat it this way. So that's what we form the box skirt. You can see that it's already forming. So you pleat those two to give it a kissing pleat. It's called, see, that's how to do it. Um, let me grab my pins. Yeah, grab my pins somewhere. So, guys. So I will do that and I'll come back to you. So, so guys, so for clarity, one more time, I'm going to do the pleating so that if you don't understand it yet, you can understand it. So I told you that you will mark your fabric by three inches, three, another three inches, like three, six, nine, 12, 18. So you, you take your fabric this way. Now I'm doing the pleating. So I'm almost done. I just want to do it again so that you can see it. So you, you fold it this way. You take one one marking to meet the uh, to meet the other. So this is one pleat. You pin it down. Then you take the other one and fold it to meet the one you have folded. So that will form the pleats. That is why it is called boss pleated. I'll do another one and mark this place. So I'll I'll fold it to meet another marking. And I will take the remaining space and fold it. 
that way it will form the pleating the box pleating shape that you want so i'm going to pin it down then i'll go and iron it out and bring it back then before i do that i already cut my my waistband this is this is three inches weight band i'm going to iron it as well and, and use it for my waist okay so what i'm going to yeah so what you do is to measure your waist when you measure this one doesn't have pockets so um, i didn't include pockets in this one this is a like a diy quick way to make a skirt in case you have an outing that you quickly want to wear something into you can quickly you know make this skirt in like five six minutes so i'm going for waist 30 I have like 31 inches here this is a three inch three yards fabric so i have waist 31 yes yeah, so i'm just going to use invisible zipper like you know half an inch to for the closure invisible zipper half an inch you take it on both sides so i'm going to go and iron it and i'll come back and show you the effects thanks hi guys so this is the finished effect of the skirts. You can see it's really looking nice. If you are the one that you don't like gathered skirts, this is really pretty. You can see that the box pleated really came out, and uh, the, the 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 size of the band I used was three inches, three inches waistband. It really really came out nice. All right, guys, thank you for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe like and share this video that will really help my channel to 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 get better thank you so much and god bless see you in my next video bye